Hello Scorpios, happy birthday. So this is gonna be a preview of the mid-month. Um, so I'm gonna switch up the spreads for this reading. I'm gonna first start with the tarot. This is gonna be with the love part. And then I'm also going to go to family, friendship, and also career as well, okay? So let's first start with love. This magician card was keep popping up. I was shuffling okay so i feel like whatever you're manifesting it's gonna come through okay so universe what's the current energy between scorpios and the person that's on scorpio mind for november the 15th to 30th 2021 so there is will of fortune ace of swords ten of cups beautiful so i feel like um things yeah whatever you want to manifest whatever you've been wishing is coming through and this could be with family. I feel like your family is going to be a balance, healthy communication. Things are looking good. Okay. Money looking good. Okay. If you've been wanting a new job, a new career path, I'm seeing you going to go have that new job or you're going to go to that new direction. Okay. It's like a good karma. Okay. Universal person that's on Scorpio mind. What would we like to say to Scorpio? for November the 15th to the 30th, 2021. Page of Cups, okay. They would like to apologize if this is a new connection. They just are very interested in you. So what they would like to say is that they're very interested in you. Universe, the person that's in Aquarius mind, why are they keeping hidden from Aquarius? I said Aquarius. <laughs> Universe, the person that's on Scorpio mind, why are, they, why are they keeping hidden from Scorpio? For November the 15th to the 30th. Could be Aquarius. Um, I have the King of Wands, Knight of Cups, Six of Cups, I mean, Six of Pentacles, and the King of Swords. So what they keep in hidden. Interesting. <laughs> I got a lot of um, masculine energy. Okay. This is this can go two ways, okay? I feel like this is majority of you guys. Um, this is someone who may feel like you get a lot of um, suitors. Like, you have a lot of people who want you okay um but they're not trying to appear like they're jealous okay they're not trying to appear that they're possessive now this is not gonna apply to a lot of scorpios but this person could be someone who is bisexual or pansexual pansexual okay um but you probably wouldn't expect that you probably wouldn't um thought that they they're like that too okay universe the person that's on scorpio mind how do you feel about Scorpio for November the 15th to the 30th, 2021? Ace of Cups. So this can be a new person here. Um, how do they feel about you? They feel like things are going really well with you. They have a lot of emotions if this is a new person already. If this is someone that you've been dealing with, um, the love is getting deeper, basically. I might name it that. Universe, the person that's on Scorpio mind, what is their true feelings for Scorpio? for November 15. Look at this, Imprints. They definitely see you as wifey material, husband material, someone that they can commit to in the long run. Universe, a person that's on Scorpio mind. What is their intentions with Scorpio? Devil. <laughs> okay. Their intention is for you to not go anywhere. Okay. Again, I feel like this person is very possessive. Okay. Could be Taurus. Universe, a person that's on Scorpio mind, what actions would he take with Scorpio? The moon. Yeah, they're going to be trying to match you. They're going to try to be mysterious, okay? Scorpio is a mysterious sign. They're going to try to be matching your energy. But in reality, they're really possessive. They're, um, they wear their heart on their sleeve and they really get attached to you. And I'm seeing that they are getting attached to you if this is a new connection. If this is a previous, um, not previous, but this is somebody you've been connecting with for quite some time. The love is just getting deeper, okay? But they already want you all to themselves, okay? It's just that they don't want to show you that they're jealous, okay? Um, so the sign of this person, um, strong Taurus energy. There's some Capricorn here. There's Libra. There's Aries. And there is Pisces Cancer, okay? Could be, yeah, Pisces Cancer. Yeah. So let's look at the other deck. Let's see what's going on. Okay. All right, 
So universe, give me a four card spread. Okay, so there's listening. So this is someone who's going to be listening to you. Okay, um, they're going to listen to everything that you got to say, like things that you may feel like they're not going to remember, they're going to remember. Um, so again, if it's like birthday, your birthday is about to come up, they're going to give you exactly what you want. Okay, being very specific of what you want to like, you probably thought they wouldn't be that detailed okay or that meticulous but they are okay and then there is message and can we get one more card universe me one more card okay there's less and rigid okay so they're addicted to you sexually i feel like they're really emotionally attached and their self-worth okay let's see what else i'm getting okay universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have okay so there's great fortune. Universe, give me three more cards. There's family room in reverse. Universe, give me two more cards. There's main female. Universe, give me one more card. Universe, give me one more card. Occupation and concern. So yeah, this is someone who's going to impress you. They're going to really go out and beyond for you around your birthday season, even during Christmas, Thanksgiving, Black Friday. They're going to do that. Now, I do got the warrior and family room in reverse. This, If this is someone new, okay, and you have kids, they, okay, this is what I'm getting. I feel like your kids don't like them. You know, but stuff like family room in reverse. Your kids don't like them, okay? This could be also the person that you have children with. Um, your baby father, baby mother don't like this newer person, okay? Um, I feel like you might meet this person at work, okay? Or you guys met at work, okay? This is someone who's very, ups like, I'm um, not obsessed, but they, they put a lot of hard work at, okay? They put a lot of hard work. Um, but at the same time, they want a connection with you. They feel like they can balance their worth ethic with you as well. Universe concern. Somebody in your family don't like this person. That's what I'm getting. It doesn't necessarily need to be blood family. It could just be your baby mother, baby father. Okay. They don't like this new person. Okay. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, give me a four card spread. So there's advocate. Universe, give me three more cards. There's teacher. Universe, give me two more cards. There's attic. Universe, give me one more card. Detective and child magical. Yeah, rebel. Yeah, see, it could be your child or children who don't like this new person. It could be theirs too, their own children that's acting that way towards you. But I feel like even if there's some friction when it comes to family, it's like this person's willing to fight for you. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Um, also, random message, if you do have a child, children, um, probably there is a teacher that is like not the right teacher or right professor for your child. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. Like this is a teacher that lack empathy and sympathy they're not really good to, they shouldn't be a teacher basically. Okay. This is like someone who's kind of like a bully. That's what I'm getting as well. Okay. Or they trying to, um, they trying to make your child feel like they're not, um, equip. Okay. That's what I'm getting. That's a random message. <laughs> so let's see. Let's look at general message now. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What general messages do you have? Universe, what messages do you have for Scorpios for November the 15th to the 30th? So there is empathy. Yep. Universe, give me three more cards. Fear. Universe, give me two more cards. Universe, give me two more cards. Self-esteem, that card keep coming out. Universe, give me one more card guilt general energy is discipline 
So I feel like this is referencing again back to that random message with if you have a child or children. Um, I feel like what the universe wants you to do is got to kind of put like extra be more attentive to one of your children or all your children okay to make them believe in themselves more to be more confident because i feel like they have somebody around them in school it could be a teacher it could be um just a, another student that's making them believe that they're not equipped or they can't do something so it's like the universe wants you to kind of be more attentive to that child or children to your children to make them believe in themselves more okay so they can be more confident Okay, they just need to be consistent. Okay, but through consistency, you need motivation, and through motivation, you need it's through confidence. Okay, so I feel like they just need to be more um, confident. Okay, and I think that's why the empathy is there. Because I was just talking about empathy. Um, it's like you, you, you guys are feeling like your children need just an extra push, and I feel like this is more of encouragement. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Okay, let's look at family and friendship, even though it's already talking about family here. And this probably not necessarily could, like, if you don't have kids, it could be, like, a younger sibling, okay? Or a friend that feel like a sister or a brother to you, okay? Okay, universe, we have four cards spread. What's going to happen with Scorpio's family and friends? Okay, there's a lot of cards here. So there's money opportunity, Sagittarius, happy home, justice, and Scorpio. So, and then two of cups. Okay, so a friend might help you make some more money. They might give you, they might give gift you something towards your birthday where you can invest in something with your business. Um, invest in something, okay? They might give you something financially, monetarily. Okay, or they might help you get a new job, okay, or inspire you. That's what I'm seeing, especially if this is a Sagittarius, a Libra, another Scorpio friend. Um, with family, I don't see any beef with you guys together. It just, I do see like just, there's probably an outsider. Um, and then what, like your child or children is getting affected by this outsider. But I feel like what the universe wants you to do is kind of just give them a word of encouragement. Make them feel like um, like they know of themselves. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. But I see family is going to get really balanced um, for the last two weeks. Okay, I see you're going to get some more opportunities through a friend or through a family member as well to make more money. Okay, let's look at work. Let's see what's going on with work. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Scorpio? For November the 15th to the 30th, 2021. Universe, give me one more card. Okay, right, general energy is for business owners. How's your marketing? Okay, so the universe probably want you to improve your marketing. It's about to be, uh, especially if you're relating to sales, okay? Um, it's about to be Black Friday, about to be the holidays. The universe wants you to upgrade your marketing, okay? Um, then there is change your social circle. Aquarius had that too. Um, try a different market. Yeah, it's all about marketing. So I feel like the universe wants you to focus on how can you get your marketing to the next level? How can you improve your marketing? Okay, if you have your business, even if you, um, I just say you're not relating to like products, but like you're a service, okay, like just say you're a realtor, okay, or um, yeah, you just, I give an example of a realtor, probably you need to change your marketing. Um, probably you do social media a lot, probably need to um, go through Google, like probably advertising through Google, even though those are expensive. <laughs> but you know, see how can you, mark it in a different way but it's probably going to be giving you a more um clientele it's going to give you more business okay um find your passion and make a business with it and then there is uh, the time is now aquarius got that too in a contraction phase okay so 
well the time is now in contraction phase i feel like what i'm trying to say is like do not procrastinate okay um you're able to make way more money than you did ever before but you have to implement something new okay so it doesn't become stagnant so it doesn't become stuck so the universe wants you to try something different when it comes to your marketing now you just say you have you just work um for a business it could be like how can you how can like your manager the directors notice you more like figure out something how they can notice you more and implement that be consistent with that okay so you can get to that next level of success when it comes to your field of work okay so that's the messages that i have for you scorpios thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal with me at queenfitterarot at gmail.com